So I'm having fun here, uh, playing with HRD, Ham Radio Deluxe, and uh, I spent most of the day kind of playing around with the rotator tool inside of Ham, Amateur or Ham Radio Deluxe. I've never used it before, you know, that I'm creating a rotator, it's uh, been interesting and kind of fun to play with. Tracking a satellite called Sprout, I really don't have an antenna or anything hooked up, this is just for the sake of trying out the rotator stuff. You probably or may have seen the mechanical rotator that I have that I 3D printed and what I'm doing is I'm working on the electronics portion. And I've got over here, um, if you've seen the other video, this is a uh, Trinket Pro. It's the Hackaday version which is kind of cool. Two, two stepper sticks to drive the, drive the motors which I don't actually have hooked up right now. I'm kind of working on the, ro the rotator interface. And here I've got a Max32 chip. It's basically emulating or, or uh, creating a, a COM port. So this is the COM port out of the computer right here. So what I have is the rotator software. It's connected to COM1. And uh, what I've done, let me focus in here. Let's let this connect real quick. So what I've done is I've, I've found some of the specifications for this ESU GS232A and uh, just kind of doing some serial port hacking just to see what the protocol looks like. And uh, so what I'm, I'm doing is instead of creating my own protocol, I'm just mimicking the ESU protocol. So I'll go ahead and connect. I want to do connect. It's basically going out that COM port and going into this serial port through the Arduino, and the Arduino is basically thinking that, making it look like it's a rotator. So the idea is I'll use the same commands and same protocol as that Yesu rotor, and I'll drive, drive my stepper motors accordingly. It's actually pretty simple. It's just serial out commands. Um, this log file here kind of tells you what, what it's sending, what it's expecting. And you can see, now that it's plugged in, it is tracking this satellite here. It's a wire letter that's coming overhead. It's pointing nearly south there. So what's happening is I've kind of got it faked out with a COM port. It basically sends out the go-to command to the antenna, and then the Arduino is feeding back its position as if it had moved to that position. And what you see here are the dials of what the rotator thinks it's at. So I think it's pretty cool. On the second monitor here, I've got Google Earth. I've always loved this part of Ham Radio Deluxe. You can, um, once you have Google Earth installed, you can mess with these two sliders here and um, see what the satellite is seeing. So you can kind of see, you know, as it goes overhead, there's my, my house over here somewhere. Here, like Michigan, so as it comes up overhead, you can kind of see what's going on. And I do have my radio turned on just in case. I don't, I'm not expecting any, anything. Actually, it's pretty close to the other thought. I hear anything, I've heard of something by now. Anyways, that's what I was kind of working on today is just the ro rotator interface, just basic serial connection stuff. Pretty, pretty darn simple. Um, Having fun there.